Philippine news today. Please subscribe and then check notification box to get all breaking news alert. Evan Hurst is a disgusting, lying leftist hack reporter who is getting attention for writing an article titled Go FCK Yourself, Sarah Huckabee Sanders, You Debased Redneck Motherfucker. Hurst is a nobody who wanted attention, and now, he's got it. Patriots love President Donald Trump's press secretary, who takes heat from the idiots and the mainstream media daily. Hearst thought wrong when he attacked America's favorite press secretary, and you'll love how he gets a nasty surprise. Keeping an eye on the liberal loser media is a full-time job, but nothing has shocked Trump supporters more than the unwarranted attack on Sarah Huckabee Sanders. The White House press secretary had to endure reporter April Ryan accusing her of not baking the pecan chocolate pie she posted on social media over Thanksgiving, and now, there is this idiot, Evan Hurst. Usually, we wouldn't give such trash the time of day, but in the same way that Trump vanquishes his detractors, there are times to shed light on these evil rats. So warning, there is some explicit language in this article, although we kept it to a minimum. Twitchy's senior editor felt the same way, reporting, writing this as a Twitchy editor is interesting because we use our fair share of blue-ish language in headlines and in copy, it seems a natural part of snark. He adds, that being said, there are certain words and phrases even we avoid because we know they're just unacceptable and tacky. Like this crap, and it is crap. From Juan Cat Senior Editor, Evan Hurst, Go FCK Yourself, Sarah Huckabee Sanders, You Debased Redneck Motherfucker. Sarah Huckabee Sanders has seriously gotten under their skin, and the slim pristed, whiny headline proves it. It is not just the headline, we went ahead and took a look at what this buffoon had to say, and it was just a pack of lies so thick, only very brainwashed leftists could think it had any truth. Hearst sarcastically asks whether Sanders' worst act of the week was when she defended her white supremacist boss Donald the Stupid after he hurled racism at Navajo code talkers who helped us win World War II by telling them all about mean old Pocahontas in the Senate. Right, seems poor useful idiot Evan missed out on Elizabeth Warren's lies about her papa. Hearst goes on to say that Warren never lied, nope. Except, it's all on video. And it's fairly simple to do a search to find Pocahontas telling us how she knows that she has American Indian blood running through her veins. Nothing like Warren's Aunt B's comments about high cheekbones to verify her ethnic background. If you think Warren took a simple DNA test to prove her Aunt B's story, you'd be wrong. Warren used this fable to mark X in the American Indian box when she applied to be a professor at Harvard, and it worked. So, what else does the leftist hack have on Sanders? It must be something really good since he called her names no one would ever repeat in polite company. Hearst reports, hands down, the worst sin against common decency Sarah Huckabee Sanders committed this week was her response to Trump tweeting anti-Muslim torture porn on Wednesday morning, sourced from British white supremacists who make American white supremacists look like, okay let's just say it's a tie as to who has the worst white supremacists. Obviously, Evan Hurst and his ridiculous website called Wong Ket have never seen real explicit beheadings or Islamic terrorists raping children. One video showed Muslims smashing a Virgin Mary statue, the other one, taken from a good distance away, showed a man being thrown off a roof. Both videos would be rated PG-13, yet he calls it anti-Muslim porn. That's all he has got. For those reasons, Hearst called Sanders, well, you know what he called her. One Twitter user told Hearst, this is how liberal male active and her streets women. Still surprised at all these sexual assault revelations on the left. And Hearst is so unstable that he responded with, he should see how I treat men. Hearst seems like a stalker. His hate is palpable, and it seems the poor sap has snapped. Now that Twitchy has alerted patriots that a real nut job is on the loose, the one cat wacko is getting nasty surprises all over his Twitter thread from those who love Sarah Huckabee Sanders. We are exposing his lies, which wasn't challenging at all because they were so ridiculous. He wanted the attention, and in the process, he is in way over his head.
His article reads like a manifesto from a whacked follower of Che Guevara. I'm sure he'll be getting a visit from the Secret Service, who take seriously signs of mental instability like Hearst is showing. Hopefully, he will get help. Liberalism is a mental disorder, but this guy is showing such pent-up hostility, it's really creepy. This might just be a severe case of Trump derangement syndrome, and the only cure is accepting reality and learning the truth. Share the story and leave a comment by clicking one of the buttons below. Follow us on Facebook at Mad World News.